So today I'm going to be looking at the Ginemok, let's see, what is it called? The Ginemok M1, or Nimok, it's G-N-I-M-O-C, is that right? Ginmok. So, yeah, um, it's obviously based on the Asgard mothership from Stargate SG-1. It's built by Brutal Cookie, and... Uh, like I say, it's another. This is the second ship of this sort of design that we've seen, so it's an interesting take on it. And uh, we're going to take a little look around and see, see what how you know, see what it is about. It's got a lot of detail going along along the outside there. A lot of detail going along there. Uh, some big old guns sticking out there. <laughs> it's interesting. Big old turret. I think that must be a turret. It must be a turret. There's two of them on each side, so uh, I can't see because uh, it's part of it, if that makes sense. It's got his logo on the side, faction logo, I'm guessing. A nice sort of tower on there. Which is interesting. Uh, I suppose they could be fighters. They've got engines. can't really tell so yeah that's pretty much the exterior Let's have a look underneath it yeah it's quite similar I've got a giant gun underneath I'd expect more turrets yeah four turrets underneath how many turrets on top four turrets on top and what have we got here Kill count 20. <laughs> oh, excellent. <laughs> and then over here, what have we got? Uh, and that is the name of the ship, guys. I think it might be Nimok M1. I'm not, I'm not 100%, but look at the detail. Let's take a little bit of a uh, closer look on some of these features here. So, uh, we've got a nice little pattern there. It looks great when you're going by, because it's sort of has some depth to it, so the pattern actually changes. Got another cool pattern here, and what looks like some kind of well, they're not stairs, obviously, but it's just detail, isn't it? More detail. Got these funny patterns going on from a distance. It looks like a strange, it looks like a texture or some kind of plating. So I think this is a hanger. So let's just stop here, and I'll go and have a look. So we've got a really big hangar. So we're going to walk to the end of the hangar. Should have should have driven my uh, should have flown my ship in here really and parked it up at the ends. But hey. So it looks like there is um, uh, quite an expansive interior going on here. So uh, let's just chuck in here. What have we got? Okay, so if I go down, 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 and there he is. I think you see me. So it's quite moody, but then the Asgard ships were quite moody. So uh, yeah, hello buddy. Let's go. Let's go. I think he's going to show me around a little bit. Ah, lovely. So, looks like this is the core room. Oh, beautiful. So let's have a look through the cameras. So we had one on the bridge, one at the front, another one even more at the front, one on the core, and then the main 
so the main bridge cam. Um, checking out the weaponry, we've got a cloaker, a jammer, uh, we got D1000s. And a weapons computer. So if I just aim it, move the ship a little bit. D1000. Okay. So let's take a look at this. Okay, so one. We've got some guns firing out there. Okay, and we've got missiles. Okay, missiles. No, they didn't fire. Oh, why the missiles stop? Weird. On this ship, we have a mass of 274,000 with a thrust of 323,000. We have a length of 397, a height of 184, and a width of 305. We have a power of 35 million total and 25 million energy per second recharge. The X axis is one, the Y axis is one, and the Z axis is one. Shields. 7 million shields with a 109,000 shields per second recharge. Recovery 5. 